Since the Radeon HD 3870X2, AMD has aimed to release a dual GPU variant of its higher end graphics cards. These dual GPU cards have also become the hallmark for graphics card manufacturers and much of the issues that existed in the past have been fixed. With the new Radeon R9 295X2, AMD has slapped two fully unlocked wide cores on a single PCB and aims to take back the crown from Nvidia. After multiple teasers, which consisted of sending reviewers pictures with the hashtag 2 better than 1, AMD has finally released a much anticipated dual Hawaii card. Unlike previous designs, the reference R9 295X2 features a built-in all-in-one liquid cooler to cool the GPUs and a fan in the middle to cool the VRM. Same as with the R9 290 series, AMD has given the R9 295X2 a 512-bit memory bus with a total of 8GB of VRAM. It also features twice the shader units, ROPs, and transistors of the 290X. All of this performance, however, comes at a cost. Considering the R9 290Xs were such power-hungry cards, the dual GPU variant is no different. The R9 295X2 is a 500 watt card, which is the first reference card with a 500 watt TDP from either Nvidia or AMD. Dissipating 500 watts of heat also takes a lot of engineering. AMD decided that a normal air cooling solution wasn't going to cut it, so they went ahead and implemented a closed loop liquid cooling unit on the reference design. There are two Azatec pumps and a single 120mm radiator that are designed to cool the GPUs. The VRMs are left to be cooled by a single fan in the middle. This new design doesn't come as a surprise, however, as the original reference design R9 290Xs ran pretty darn hot at 94 degrees Celsius. Taking into account the price of the card, AMD has beefed up the quality and the metal components offer a touch of luxury that we have been accustomed to with Nvidia's higher end offerings. The R9 295X2 uses a mixture of plastic and metal and offers a unique aesthetic considering the card is cooled with a closed loop solution. To sum it up, AMD has really stepped up its game and has delivered what we believe to be an excellent product. Not only is it the fastest graphics card that we have ever tested, it also comes in at a reasonable price point. The power requirements is a tough one and you need to make sure that you buy a power supply that will work with your graphics card. If you use a power supply of cheaper quality, you run the risk of melting wires and rendering the card useless. Seeing the all-in-one cooling solution on a reference design was a welcomed addition. It allowed the card to run cool and quiet as well as fix the issues that we had with the original R9 290X. In essence, the R9 295X2 is a beast and is definitely the best graphics card currently out on the market for gaming.